right, it's time for my favorite segment of the entire week right now. Yes. <laughs> and that would be garden oh, goodies. Garden goodies, yeah. yes. Sorry. Yes, but uh, Justin, obviously you're not out in your garden this morning. Mm -hmm. No, not this morning. I went on the road. I went to the Salvation Army to talk about what you can do with some of your extra food during the summer. Okay. We just got done with the Channel 9 food drive, and of course, with many food drives, we often ask for canned goods or non-perishable items, but it's also important for people to get fresh food, and that's why I'm here at the Salvation Army with Colleen Hilber here, and talk a little bit about your fresh food that you get here and how important that is during the summer. So, uh, actually, we do all year round. Um, it's not just during the summer. Um, all year round, we have our bread and produce line that is open up to the public to come in. We're servicing around 100 families um, a day that come in and receive the fresh produce um, or bread or whatever. We pick up from local grocery stores, we um, farmers that bring it in, um, or people that they get the fresh salads, the carrots, the potatoes, anything um, as far as that goes. Apples, oranges, when your apple trees start ripening and you don't know what to do with them all, you can bring them in and they'll go to a good use for many people. Yeah, that's right. Uh, for my garden, when I have excess stuff, I drop it off here. Uh, and that's just at the downtown location here in Wausau? Yes, at the 202 Callen Street location. We're open Monday through Friday from 8.30 a.m. till about 3 p.m. Um, Monday through Thursday until 1 p.m. on Fridays. And any donations can be dropped off at any time during those hours. Yeah, it's a wonderful thing you can do if you pick up excess stuff from the uh, farmer's market or if you're a gardener and you have excess things, uh, donate it to the Salvation Army or other food banks in the area. All right, well, awesome. I mean, hopefully the goal is to always have kind of more than you need and hopefully you right. can And you know, you know I like to grow green beans. What did I say mm -hmm. about it? There's Little always a, work and a lot. And you get a lot yes. of beans, mm -hmm. yeah. And that's something that, you know, sometimes I have a lot of extra beans. I'll donate yep. them to a food pantry. And cool. uh, I know other gardeners I talk to out in the area do that as well. Okay. You know, they almost always have a lot of access. And when my dad used to have a big garden, he'd like be trying to give away things. We have so many <laughs> zucchinis, so many whatever, and you're yeah. begging people to take them. Yeah. Well, now we there have a spot for you. Just take them down there. And we want to take Cam one quick and take a look at these. Uh, Ooh, there was delicious. a much bigger mound about yeah. three minutes ago, Justin, yeah, green before beans. we got at them. Yeah, yeah, we were talking about green beans and donating green beans and excess green beans. And I thought, well, I'll give you a, I know you mentioned you had some of the deep fried green beans at a restaurant. Yep, mm -hmm. yep, down at Stevens Point. Uh, that's the only thing I have to compare to. These are excellent. Now, I said uh, uh, the green bean flavor kind of gets outweighed by the beer batter flavor, but probably a lot of people looking for that if I they're guess. deep frying their vegetables, right? <laughs> So. <laughs> That's right. So yeah. it's, it turned out good. I'm happy. Uh, yeah, if you want to get that recipe for deep frying, uh, you know, with some beer batter on your mm -hmm. green beans mm -hmm. for a little treat. And of course, don't forget the dill dip recipe dill from dip. a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, yep. that's so. on our website, wow.com. Yeah, I'm sorry my mouth was full that whole time. I've been having a lot of these. Green beans are my favorite vegetable. So yeah, there but uh, there we go. hopefully you go to that they're website, a, make them yourself. They're a winner. They are a <laughs> winner. Well, don't go anywhere. We've got your top stories coming up after this break.